Hey guys, let's uh, carry on with Sniper Elite 4, shall we? Doing the Bitanti Village, which is the second mission on Sniper Elite, because, you know, if it's on normal, it's too easy. Um, I recently reached level 30, so I can have three of an item now. I've chosen to use that skill, and that's not the loadout I want, that's the loadout I want. That's not the sniper rifle. Oh wait, there this is. I've switched over. I got the, uh, the Springfield to mastery level, so I've moved on to the Gewehr 43. My favourite gun from the last three games I've played. <laughs> uh, right. Let's begin. Really nice loading time. One name kept coming up from Sansolini. Andreas Kessler. Genius rocket scientist. Pioneer of guided missile technology. Philanderer. Alcoholic. Committed Nazi. Kessler's specialty was long-range missiles. But SOE thought he couldn't solve the radio control issues. The destruction of the Orchidea suggests we were wrong. Very wrong. There's no doubt the Orchidea was an easy target for a test. But if the Nazis have a controllable long-range missile, it would completely transform the war in their favor. American intelligence, OSS, think Kessler is in Italy, probably under the protection of a brutal Nazi general called Heinz Bohm. I've been dispatched to the coastal town of Batanti to meet our OSS contact. With the invasion of Sicily imminent, it's crucial we find out what the Nazis are up to. Hmm. So. Red Fox calling Mother Hen. Red Fox calling Mother Hen. Receiving you, Red Fox. American observation plane has spotted relay tower on outskirts of town. Neutralize mobile radio operator before he can summon reinforcements. Also, deal with the sniper. Out. Red Fox out. Right, uh, it seems a bit of an odd. Hello? Lieutenant Carl Fairburn. Nice job on Sansolini, especially given the circumstances. A lot of brave men died on the Orchidia. We need to make sure their sacrifice was worth it. We need to find Kessler. Yep, they told me you were a to-the-point kind of guy. I'm Jack Weaver, by the way. OSS appreciates the necessity for urgency, Carl, but we have to be a little careful here. What do you know about Heinz Bohm? The Butcher of Bologna. Yeah. Bohm is a sadistic bastard. A slippery one, too. We still don't know what he looks like. Oh, his handiwork, though, well, it's everywhere. We think he's the one handling Kessler. Find Bohm, find Kessler. I get it. Your people think the best bet is to reach out to the local resistance. Given our past experience with the Partisans, we, uh... Think it might be a little difficult, but we're willing to give it another try. I need a name and a location. The leader is a woman by the name of Sofia de Rocco. They, huh, they call her the Angel. You'll find her in the town. Okay, I'll give it a try. Carl, listen to me. The Nazis have been conducting a rastrolamento. They've been sweeping up the town, rounding up partisans, and... Chances are the executions have already begun. Do you know where they are? Your guess is as good as mine. Partisans have an HQ. You find that, might be some help. I'm on it. Carl? This place... It's a tinderbox. You just need to find something to start the fire. Hmm. 
<laughs> Who are you? Hey, you don't sound too well. You must be Lieutenant Fairburn. I've been told to take you to our leader, Sophia. We call her the Angel. I'll make my own way. The fascists have conducted a rastrellamento. They've gone through the town, taking our people. The Angel is planning a rescue. She sounds like a brave woman. You know about Commando Bethel. Fear can issue whatever orders he likes. You're a commando. It means they will shoot you on sight rather than take you prisoner. This doesn't scare you. Occupational hazard. <laughs> <laughs> it's good death doesn't frighten you. This place has seen a lot of it. Just look in the graveyard. The dead might tell you more than the living. I think that was a hint. I immediately switched to press rounds. <laughs> Better see if I can locate the partisan HQ. Easy, does it? How? How did he not see that? Down. But I did kind of play the beginning of this, so I know roughly what's going on. Damn boat's going to make an approach via the beach tricky. Damn it, I can't hit it from this angle. Not good enough. Can't find anything else. I see you over there. There's the sniper. Let's see. Damn it. There we go. Ooh, snapped his spine. God. Long shot rank A. Really? 250 meters is grade A? That's like... 300 being... S rank? I need to mark that boat.
Right then, oh balls. I should have tagged everyone first. It's a bit weird when you can hear people cough. It's because you have some kind of magical directional mic on your scope. like a nice bit of timing. Nope, there's another one down there, obviously. What? I guess I grabbed everything useful. I know I'm hurt, I will heal up eventually. Just giving the area a good scan. Oh well, I'm going to have to deal with it. I'm uh, too hurt. First eagle.
Nothing else. Oh, come on. Be nice to find some flipping bandages. Damn it. Oh, I've got a bandage. Didn't notice. Ah, <laughs> oh, that's better. Da bist du ja. Guter Mann. Na klar. Schließlich gibt's eine Belohnung. Also, wo fangen wir an zu suchen? Am besten Oststrand. Der Kerl dürfte ein wenig riechen, schätze ich. Wie lange lag er jetzt im Wasser? Halte die Nase zu und denk an die Belohnung. Vorsichtig jetzt! Ja, halten wir lieber die Augen auf. Nein, damn it. Oh, twenty five point nine, bloody hell. This will come in very useful. Yep. Whatever it was, I don't know. Right, take a break there. I didn't realise I've been going on for so long. <laughs> um, so I'll see you guys in a second.